hello friends welcome to the another video session as a tester or a developer in a test uh, we always face challenges to identify uh, some uh, color of the element on the web page uh, today i'm going to show you one tool if you are developing uh, or if you are testing something and you want to uh, describe the color of the object or the uh, page or a font so that time uh, you can use this uh, browser extension that will uh, make your work first to get it you need to go you need to go to the you need to open the browser and you have to go to the google uh, chrome store and then you have to go for the uh, add-on called colorzilla you have to type colorzilla here and you have to search for it then it will appear here the first one then if you click over it it will give information uh, and it's uh, all about the feature what it is used for it has very nice feature that uh, help you to help you to uh, boost your work uh, it has a advanced color picker and eyedropper and more more and also it has a color analyzer that that help you to report a lot of issues uh, with uh, your testing work so to get it you need to click on add-on chrome once uh, it done it will appear uh, on the your right uh, top side of the browser icon so if you see it is over here now so once you install it also take you to the uh, colorzilla page where they describe the features again what they meant for to test it this tool uh, what i do i will go to the website any website you can go uh, and and i will click over uh, colorzilla icon once i click uh, the uh, number of menu and menu options appear here but uh, for us uh, we need a, a color picker that means it will identify the color of the object so i use this tool and if i want to know what is uh, this one if i move my mouse cursor it already started showing uh, me the a code the color of the code is like uh, if you see a uh, hash f9 a300 and also it show in the rgb color uh, and so on if you move your mouse cursor some other part of the application also it will uh, show the color if you move on the image also it will show what is a color exactly of the image it show in rgb and it's also showing uh, that you can do a code that can use also uh, it it also show the dimension of the image for example this image what i am at the moment it is uh, 442 into 462 if i move move my cursor and look for this logo it is 121 into 440 so such information it will show like also uh, it also show more information like what font size if i move here and if you look over there it image with the anchor but if i move my mouse cursor to top story it is a h2 uh, in the html s2 this all you can find also in a debugger mode pressing the uh, near keyboard going to debugger mode pressing the f12 uh, also you can identify the same things but if you don't have how to use debugger if you new to the uh, testing and this tool uh, might help you a lot and it's also avoid you to going to debugger more and finding more information and this tool also has a much more features here if you click over here and it's also bring us a color picker option so so if i move my mouse cursor and it starts showing what color it is and so on so it has also one more uh, feature copy to clipboard that means it uh, copy if you want to copy a this code uh, to the notepad if you click over it it will 
copy the information what kind of format you want if you want to rgb color or you some want other format for the uh, for the uh, bug or issue information you are creating it is pretty much useful uh, if you go also it has some other features also it will take you to the history that means uh, if you already picked it will also show you picked history what it is and so on so it's also uh, bring us some more options such as uh, web page color analyzer if I click over here uh, it also analyze the color of the web page and if you click uh, one of the element it will take you directly over there that place where this color is mentioned so if you play around this tool you understand more and uh, this will uh, help you to identify so many things on the web page with the CSS code and if, if I if we click here it has m many more options uh, it also has a platter browser option these all are useful for uh, for you to uh, reporting the issues so once you uh, start using this tool you understand more how you can use this and improve your daily routine work thanks friends i hope you like this my video uh, if you like Please share with your friend, uh, then he can also use this tool and uh, improve his productivity. And if you know some other tools, uh, please make a comment to the video so I can also review those uh, tools or add ons or whatever uh, that will more related to the testing and developer in test position, or maybe some other tools also you can recommend me to review. Okay, friends, see you in next video.